So for the final time, let's head back to Omaka Maratu and claim the universe sentinel. The prismatic egg and hoping our best for a secret here, or at least a pet I don't have. Don't be a magnish. That's fun. Catch a thousand fish. That's fun. I'm gonna die. In this video, I completed the final 15 Omaka Maratu quests, and it was painful. I also opened the new prismatic egg that I got from the final quest, got a secret pet, and fished for about 10 hours. I never want to touch a fishing rod ever again. Subscribe if you're new, and enjoy my pain. And that's quest 16 completed. Well, it's not completed yet, but all I gotta do is sell a thousand fish, and I believe I have a thousand fish. So let's go over here, and then go fish exchange, and sell all our fish, and there we go. We can go speak to Omaka Maratu. Mr. Maka Marasu, I have done your quest. What is the next one I have to do? I have to just catch a load of fish again. Should be pretty easy. While I'm here, I'm going to buy this upgrade here. It's egg hatch plus one, because I didn't have it before. And now we head over to Maka Marasu to claim quest two. There we go. And quest three is more fishing. I just love fishing so much, game. Please keep giving me fishing quests. I hate it so much. And now we give this to Maka Marasu and hope it's not another fishing quest. Let's see what it is. It's more, it's more fishing. 50 legendary fish. 50. I have to catch 50 legendary fish. That's fun. Catch a thousand fish. That's fun. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna have nightmares about fishing. And that is Sentinel 4 completed. That one took me quite a while to get 50 whole legendary fish. Let's go back to Maka Maratu. Oh, I'm gonna buy this Prismatic Sunday for 9 billion and a looting room for 250 uh, of the gems. Anyway, let's return over here to Maka Maratu, our favorite alien, and claim the quest. There we go, and what we've got to do now is fish a lot more. My god, 75 legendary fish. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. This is just gonna take me the rest of the week. Like, what the hell? 75 legendary fish is crazy. I never want to touch a fishing rod again in my life. Genuinely, I don't want to touch one. All I have to do to complete this quest is go over to the fish exchange here, exchange my fish, and there we go. Now I just hope I never have to touch another fishing rod ever again. By the way, proof that I'm playing this game free to play, if I go player stats here, which you can turn on the settings and then you can click this, Robux spent zero. I then returned to Omaka Maratu to claim this quest, and the next one was super easy because it was just a catching quest, which was pretty easy. Then I just turned auto AFK on, and it was just a piece of cake. And that's that quest completed, which took longer than I actually thought it would, because I had to catch like 250 pets. Anyway, let's claim this from Amaka Maratu, and okay, I spoke too soon, now I've got to catch 300 of them. It may as well just say, like, uh, wait one hour or whatever, like, <laughs> bro, it's, aha, uh -huh. I've just got to click this button and wait until I catch 300 pets. And that's 300 pets a core. I don't know why they do these quests, because these quests are basically saying, sit there for a couple hours and catch some pets, but I'm not complaining, because I don't have to do anything for it. <laughs> But it does feel like a waste of time. Anyway, Omeka Maratu, claim that quest. There we go. Onto the Sentinel 8, which is the same thing, really. In fact, it's actually easier. I, I would say this is easier because realistically, I'm going to catch 25 epic pets in this map pets, and it's just 25 less pets. Anyway, I shouldn't waste any time. I'm actually going to select multiple areas because I may as well. And let's AFK. <laughs> this is going to be my life for the next, like, another hour. <laughs> Great. And that's quest number 8 completed for a Maka Maratu. Let's go over there and claim this quest and hopefully it's more catching and no more fishing. Yes it is, okay, I'm fine with that. It's basically just the same thing again, it's not too bad. And that's quest number 9 completed, let's head back to a Maka Maratu. Okay Mr. Maka Maratu, let me, uh, there we go, 5 more quests and it's mine. We just gotta catch a load of really cool pets, oh god that's gonna be painful. And that's quest number 10 completed, which means we only have 5 quests to go. Or I guess, 4 quests to go. Let's go over here to Omaka Maratu and claim the quest, there we go. And now we're on to the damage and like monster killing quests, because we went through 5 fishing quests, then 5 catching quests, and now, my favourite, because I think they're the easiest, well at least in my opinion, they're the easiest for attacking quests. And my favourite place to go kill things is obviously the Gloomy Grotto, because if you go here, go all the way over here, back behind this purple mushroom, you can stand right about here and then kill all the slimes. Of course, I'm going to use loads of these, uh, all these potions, and if I use them all, I'll just get some extra coins along the way as well. And in two more enemies, which should be just over here, we have completed a number 11. But now it's time for these quests to probably get pretty hard. Omaka Maratu, let's claim that. Yep, okay, defeating 444 enemies, 5 million damage, and defeating 5 whole King Slimes. Time to fight King Slime five times. 
which should be pretty easy considering I do quite a bit of damage. That's number one. That's kill number two. Uh, I don't think this is meant to happen. <laughs> I am still in the King Slime arena. Uh, this is definitely not meant to happen. Time to fight King Slime again. That's King Slime defeated again, and uh, this time am I going to be teleported back? Yes, I am. <laughs> time to fight him for the fourth time. That's number four. I never get like anything good from killing this guy. <laughs> and the final kill can happen right now. Let's fight him for the final time. And that's the final time I got to kill King Slime. Did I get anything good from that? No, I didn't. Time to sit in Gloomy Grotto for like 15 minutes. Where do I need to sit? I need to sit just over here behind the mushroom. Quest 12 was pretty easy. Quest 12 was very easy. I just had to kill a couple things. And now we can return to Umaka Muratu. And that means we have two quests to go. Number 13, 14, and 15. That's actually three. I can't count. But I got to defeat seven King Slimes, do 8 million damage, and defeat 500 enemies. And with one more enemy defeated, there we go, 500 enemies, now all we've got to do is kill 6 King Slimes. And that should be as easy as just killing it 6 times in a row, and uh, using a lot of my respawn tomes. And that's the final time i got to kill King Slime, well at least for this quest. So let's return to Umakamaratu, give this guy the quest, and now we are only 2 quests away from this beautiful pet, which I should have a low-ish serial number of. It won't be super low, because as I said, I am a free-to-play player, taking no donations, and I'm not, I haven't got like a great team, so it should be higher than my C champion at least. Uh-oh, quest 14, defeat 7 Krakens, level 25 plus, now this, this is a problem. Why is this a problem, you may be asking? Well, let me take you to Sunset Shores. Well, first, I'm going to catch this uh, shiny rare fox in this area, because it's kind of on brand, considering I'm crazy fox plays. I also need to catch the pets I haven't discovered yet. With the fox caught, let's go to Sunset Shores. And if we go over to the Kraken, you'll see the big problem here. My Kraken isn't even level 25, so to even start killing the seven Krakens, I have to kill five Krakens, so I have to kill... 13 Krakens. Oh god. Play the Kraken montage. And now, only one Kraken remains. Yes, I've used loads of my respawn tomes. Let's check out the number. 23. Now, I have gained a lot back from doing this, but not as many as I've spent. Maybe I'll get something rare for this final Kraken defeat. By the way, I hate killing the Kraken. It's so boring. I'd rather kill King Slime, even though that's just as boring. It's a lot faster. Surprisingly, with only four pets as I'm free to play, doing 3.2 million damage is not fun. And there we go, we've defeated the final Kraken, maybe we'll get something good from this one. I do really doubt it though, considering I get nothing good from any of these guys. To be fair, two golden cherries is quite rare. But at this point, I don't care, all we got to do is kill 650 enemies, and then we're on to the final quest. And of course, the place where we go to kill enemies is these slimes. And that's quest number 14 completed, meaning only one quest remains. Let's return to Imakamuratu for the second to last time to claim the final quest. Here we go. Defeat 1,000 enemies, deal 25 million damage, defeat 10 king crabs, defeat 10 krakens and 10 king slimes, and then we're done. So, I was just farming these krakens and king slimes off camera because realistically, you guys do not care about that at all. And I was just like radio silent doing them because I hate doing the bosses over and over again. So I wasn't really talking. There was nothing really to say. But while fighting King Slime, I got a Royal Slime pet, which is one of the rarer things you can get from this thing. As you can see here, it's a 1 in 5k and it's a pet. There it is, number 6,569 secret pet. I don't know if it's any good. You yeah, know, it's not any good. It's not my team or anything, but it's a secret pet. And I'll always take a secret pet. Anyway, time to do my remaining three King Slimes. By the way, shout out to this guy, he randomly found me in a server and he subscribed, or I assume he subscribed, he knows me at least, so, hey, you're probably watching this video, shout out to you. 
And that's everything killed. Now we just got to kill a thousand enemies and ten king crabs. We are almost done with this quest. All we got to do is kill one more king crab and 150 more enemies. And now all that remains is one singular king crab. And that's the quest done. If I'm whispering, it's because it's currently two o'clock in the morning. Let's go claim this quest. The rewards for this quest are insane. Look at them. We get a perfect cube. We get the pet. We get them and we get a prismatic egg, which I will be opening. So for the final time, let's head back to Omaka Muratu and claim the Universe Sentinel. That is every Omaka Muratu quest completed. Now we've got a prismatic egg to open and a pet to check out. We got number 2847. That's not too bad. Here are the base stats of it, which are really good base stats. Now it's time to make it shiny. Let's use golden cherries on it until it's shiny. Let's see how many it takes. It only took like five then. That was really easy. And it's shiny. This pet looks absolutely insane. Look how beautiful that is. It's now time to use our prismatic egg where we've got a 5% chance of getting a secret. Prismatic eggs only hatch into legendary pets from a region and it's got a 5% chance of being secret. So let's head up here because it looks nicer up here. Let's go into our inventory. Let's use every luck boost we can. Um, we've got the Prismatic Sunday here. That's the best we can do. Those two right there. I don't think there's anything else we can do apart from using the Prismatic Egg. And hoping our best for a secret here. Or at least a pet I don't have. Don't be a Magma Cube. Please. It is. Okay. It's of course an Inferno Cube. Magma Cube. Whatever it's called. Now it's time to try and max this pet out as much as possible. I got it to level 14 with berries, we can do the rest with scrolls. And it's now max level with these stats right here. Meaning by far it's my best pet and that's without runes, so time to put runes on it. And that's the pet maxed out, now I didn't really want lifesteal but I'll take it and we're going to use a prismatic scroll to get these altered 5, so deadly 5, looting 5, lifesteal 5. And it's of course on our team. I'm sorry that the end of this video has been very kind of quiet. It's because it's very late at night right now for me. <laughs> Goodbye.